23rd, 2013, Baltimore Polytechnic. We're at a uh, playoff game. I lost my pass, so I'm going to get a piece of paper so I can take these notes now, so I have some for you. Here we got Edmondson and Frederick Douglass playing today. We want to see the crew. After we have our little meeting at the middle of the field, everyone turn and run to their position. Here we go. Smile, guys, you are on camera. I like the hustle coming in from our wings. Back judge. Confirm everything. I want to turn, see everyone turn and run to their, run to their positions after, after the national anthem. Break. And everybody's running to their position. Starting off good, gentlemen. Okay, here we go. Kick plays will generally get a non-zoomed in view just to get some perspective. Here we go. And everybody's winding. Umpire coming up. Nice coverage of the sideline. Turns. Kills the play. Our wing official. Nice job. Coming in. Cleaning up any nonsense that might be occurring. We spot the ball on the line, which is what we want on a change of possession, kick play, anytime we can, put it on the line, so we know the line to gain is now the 50. We won't be measuring, unlike last night's game, where by uh, two minutes to go in the first quarter, we were doing our fourth measurement, and it was a well-marked field. Don't want to see that. Spot that ball on the line when we can. Our referees at about 14 yards, and we're going to zoom in on our referee for about five or six plays. Forgive me if I lose count. Okay, he's chopped it in. He's at 13 yards. Got good position. Following the play. Okay, I can see what it is. Third down, third down at about seven. Third down and five. spotted. Chops it in, setting the good pace. 15 deep, a little bit outside the tackle. Got a good view of everything, might be a pass. Well, it's third to five, so no. Loose ball. Good coverage by both wings. Both wings got back. Referee bagged it. In good positioning. The guys were off to a great start. We're going to stay with our refs. Okay. Step back. About 13 yards. A little outside the tackle. Good position. It's a running play. Second down. Wings are coming in to just under the numbers on a non-crucial spot, so that's good. Let's chop, turn and chop this thing in. And boom, we're on, we're on. Nice pace, nice pace. Second and 11. Looks like it might be a pass. Nope. Yes, stay with our quarterback. Stay with our I'm not going to talk over the loudspeaker guys, but uh, nice job by the referee on the touchdown pass that I did not see, staying with it. Now we've got that unique formation I've seen, uh, every weekend I've seen it, and the only thing we need to worry about on that try is the wings making sure we got seven on the line of scrimmage. Good job. The crew is set. 
And here we go. Everybody wants. Again, good coverage on the sidelines by our umpire and wing. Nice job, guys. Let's spot that on a line now. Let's see where we're going. The 41 looks good to me. Let's see where they put it. Yep. First down, line to gain is the 49. We're going to watch our umpire. You want a four to seven yard drop. We're at about uh, seven. That's good. He's focused. It is a pass. He steps up to the line of scrimmage beautifully. That's what we want. Nice, nice job. And uh, the play ends the back down there. Nice job, umpire. Come in. Loss of nine yards. Second down. And nice spot the ball. Down, chop it in. That's what we like. Good pace. Nice pace. Yes. Okay, we're coming back from the timeout. It's now a third and long. Third down. I'm going to watch our umpire again. Pass play coming up. As soon as he reads it, we want to see him. What we're looking for is stepping up to the line of scrimmage. The wing should be drifting downfield as soon as they read pass in five man. Here we go. Umpire is focused. Look at that. That is focus. I want to see that in the fourth quarter, too. It is a running play, so... That's why we didn't see him stepping up. Good focus, umpire. Good spot from across the field. And uh, fourth and about seven. I like to go to the back judge on the punt, so that's what we're going to do. Actually, they're going for it, so we'll stay right here with the umpire. Zoom out just a little bit. He's at six yards. He's focused. He steps up. It is a pass. He's got the line of scrimmage. Nice job, umpire. Okay, and as I switch the camera, again, I'm looking at the umpire, but back judge, I do notice as the play is coming to you, Nice job keeping a good cushion. Looked real good out of the corner of my eye. A couple more plays with our umpire. Okay, I'll, I'll mention one issue where, where we spotted the ball here, and I'll, I'll come back to that. Uh, basically, we do not want to ever spot the ball between the 10 and the 11, if we can get away with it. Especially... On a, on a long play like that when it's a first down, you, you want to spot that ball either at the 11, so we have first and 10, and we know the 1 is the line to gain, or we want to spot it at the 10 and just make it first and goal. Here now we have the potential for a measurement on a dive play at the goal line, and we don't want that. It can easily be avoided on a long gain. Half a foot either way is not going to make a difference. Watching the umpire up the middle. Nice retreat, yet keeping an eye on the action. Good job. Nice maneuverability by our umpire. Okay, we're going to have third down and goal. I'm sorry, third and about three. We're, we do not. The one, one is the line to gain. Good focus. Run up the middle. Remains focused. Okay. We got fourth down and about six. Big play, guys. Fourth down and seven. Watching our umpire. We are ready. Something happened. 
Possibly a snap, snap, snap infraction or a false start. I'm not sure. Let's see what we get. Okay. Referee. Good, sharp, crisp signal to the press box. Nice job preliminarily. Darn, your preliminary signals were just as good as your uh, signals to the press box. In fact, you fooled me. Nice job by the referee. Okay, we got fourth and about 12. Remember, the line to gain is the one. I'm just going to get a uh, back view on this one just because I think we may have a play at the goal line. Pass play. Yep. Well covered by our... Well covered by our headlines, but in back judge. Nice coverage on the play, guys, and we got a turnover on down. Okay, back judge's turn. First down at about the 13 coming out. He's at 23 yards. It is a pass. Look at that. Look at that. That is very athletic movement by that back judge. I love that. Just looks real good. Keeping good cushion. Back judge looking real good on that play. What do we have? Guys a gazelle going in to cover the flag. Or talk. What do we got? We're going to find out here in a minute. Here's our ref. Okay, on the penalty enforcement. Okay, I, I, I want to see the penalty enforcement. What we want is line judge holding the enforcement spot and the H marching off the penalty. Stick with the back judge. We got second down. We're down on the three yard line. We got two stakes. Our back judge is, is counting. Pass. Underneath. Looking very good back, Judge. Love the cushion. Love the athleticism. Nice command presence back there. Okay, third to third and long. We're gonna have another pass play coming up. Okay, uh, third and twenty on the back judge again. Man two, man two, man two. I doubt, I, I doubt our back judge is going to get beat deep today. Okay, fourth down. We're going to stick with the back judge on the punt. Back judge, we missed it, but he did signal. There we go. There we go. Okay, the ball is live, guys. Good position. You've got enough cushion there, about seven, eight yards. Usually you want to be... Uh, it's going to come up short. and the referee on the front, uh, I guess uh, most of the manuals will say that the uh, back judge should be about 10 to 12 wider than the deepest receiver and 2 to 3 yards behind him. Our back judge chose, since he had two deep receivers, I have no problem with that, uh, splitting the difference. I want to watch, I hate to come off the back judge, I want to see the wings on this play. We're inside the five goal line mechanics, so I'm going to try to get them both in the coverage. Nice job. Just what I wanted to see from the wings. Up here. I, uh, I apologize for the wide angle view, but I want to see what I, what I did just see. At the snap, both wings need to get to the goal line, and then as we saw our H, work back to the spot. I want to see that again. So we just got to stick with this wide angle, watching our two wings. Let's keep it right here. Another run play to the goal line. Excellent, guys. Excellent. Excellent. Excellent coverage by our wings. Okay, they need to tie it up, so they're going to go for two. I'm going to stay wide and watch our wings. Just get a perspective of the whole field if we can. 
Okay, we got a false start. Should, should back them up five. At least I'm looking at outside where they're going to come in and talk about it. You guys have a better look than I. We want to get this right. Okay, we got encroachment. Defense. Encroachment on defense. Okay. Lined up in the neutral zone. Ref, your signals look real good. And again, the pace is very nice. And uh, we got to go wide angle on this again. Okay, it's H. I see you pointing back. Nice job. Looks good. Run to the goal line. No good. And that is no good. No good. Excellent goal line mechanics by the crew. Beautiful guys. Beautiful. Everybody's winding. Once again, I just should say ditto on the kick coverage on this sideline. Umpire, wing official. Nice coverage of the play, guys. Um, a couple more plays with our back judge, I guess. Again, math isn't my uh, expertise, so I'm not counting well, but we're going to stick with our back judge here for a little bit. We're at the 44 going in, first down. Okay, cool. It's a run. And hustles in. Seven yard. By number one, Jaquan Alexander. He's second and three. Looks like he was conducting the orchestra out there. Okay. Nice job. Second and three. It's a pass. Top-notch coverage by our back judge. That's beautiful. Okay, this is a close call, and it looks like our line judge has him short. I don't know why, H, H, you don't want to be killing that clock. Mm. Well, remember guys, we started on the line. I, I know what, I don't even have to repeat what I was uh, thinking, but uh, I'm going to send you guys a PowerPoint on how you can successfully get through a game without ever measuring. I think uh, on that one, our line judge had him short, just came in with a good spot short. The H was killing it, so we got to get straight on that. And it should be short. Let's see. Is it? Yeah, he's about a half a foot short. The line judge was correct. That's something we can work on. Um, line judge was correct. Believe him, he came in short, and just you need to just come and say, Hey, he's short, he needs to reach the 34 yard line, and he didn't. I understand political measurements, but hey, come in strong, it's short, just say, Hey, it's fourth and short. Okay, on this one, if it's a dive play, I want to see the wings crash if it's close. That's what I want to see from the wings. We're ready to go. It is up the middle, crash. I think he's short. Good job killing the clock because it is fourth down, and I think he's short. It should go the other way. Now here, we do not want to put the ball on the line. Yeah, they're short. And uh, line judge, linesman, nice job crashing on that. And uh, good job, guys. Good job. We're on our line judge now. Counting his players. The ball is loose. And our umpire, nice job selling. He's got second down. Eight. H, why were you killing it? Okay. Remember, no need to kill the clock, guys. 
umpire had his beanbag, and you saw from up here, maybe you didn't, I saw it, I don't know if I got it on film. The umpire comes in, he's got his arm raised, hey, I've got the runner down, second down. Nice job, umpire. Back to the line, Judge. Loose. Get back, get back, get back. Nice coverage on the play by the crew. Good job, guys. Good job. Try for point. Remember, make sure we got seven on the line, guys. That's what we're looking for, basically. And then step to the goal line with the wings. Right angle. And I like, look where our umpire is, on the line of scrimmage on that broken play. What I want to point out on this is, oh, things were breaking down, and I don't know if we, you saw it or not because I was moving the camera a little bit, but I've got a better view when I'm looking with my eyes. And the umpire did an excellent job maintaining the line of scrimmage. They're probably talking about, hey, did I have anyone illegally downfield? They're talking about that. Um, but a very nice job by the umpire staying where he needs to be. Our wings were staying on the goal line. Back judge end line. It was a nice nice coverage of that broken play. What are these guys talking about? Probably just mentioned it. Hey, saying good job. This is what I had. This is what I saw. Just letting you know. Nice job. Hold on a second. Good coverage on the sidelines again. So we stick with the line, Judge, uh, for the first series, I guess. Yeah. Nice mechanics line, Judge. I love that. Boom, boom. Squared off really nice. Working outside. He's probably going to adjust the spot a little bit. Hey, nice focus, nice focus. Good job, guys. If I jump, if I jump deep, it's only because I want to see some action on a pass down there. Uh, you know, we might have a tight call deep on an interference or not, and I want to see it. That's why I jump. But we'll stick with our line judge. Very good mechanics on that play. We got second and eleven. What are we doing? Timeout. Nice job, H. Signals look good. Okay. Yeah. All right, we got our line judge again. It's a uh, second and eleven coming out of the timeout. Watching our line judge. Slide. Okay, and he's gonna square back to the spot. Beautiful. And uh, just an interesting play. I don't know if the film captured it. It was a short shovel pass. And something to think about, just for training purposes who are watching this film, if you're using this for training. I want you officials to think about on that shovel pass, many times if, if it's not caught, no one blows it, blows it dead. They think it's like a loose ball. It's just I've seen it too many times on a shovel pass that is incomplete. Guy's not blowing it dead. So it's just something food for thought to keep in mind on a shovel pass. If it's dropped, we want it blown dead. I know you guys know that, but for the rookie officials watching that, remember on those shovel passes like we just saw, if it's incomplete, blow it dead. Okay, deep. H, nice job getting down, stopping, seeing the play, and very nice coverage, and we spotted at the 32 going out on a line. Good coverage, guys. We're going to stick with our line judge a couple more plays, and we'll go across the field. This is the quarter that's not going to end. we got about 30 seconds left. Line judge counting confirmed it is a pass. He's sliding and gliding, and he's going to... Ooh, he escaped. Now he's going to come back and help with the spot and get the spot. Both wings. Nice job with the spot. Here we got second and 20. Oh, yeah. Back to look at it coming in. That is the quarter. Okay, nice job.